Hey, what's going on guys? Johnny the House Buyer here. Today we're going to be talking about the three ways to unclog your sink, okay? So we're going to go from the easiest way to the hardest way, okay? So the first thing you want to do is you want to try the liquid. Either the Drano here, right? We got the Drano. It works real good sometimes depending on what it is, right? The easy part about this is that you just, there's just three steps. You just pour, wait, you know, you just pour, wait, and then flush it with hot water, right? I mean, so number one, step number one, tr try that, okay? Well, before we go into the steps, let's take a look at this drain right here. So obviously we're taking a look at it at a sink that the drain is not working very properly, right? So the first step is to use the uh, the, the the Drano or liquid plumber, whatever. I'll leave links in the description below and all that stuff. But try the easiest thing first, right? And this one's not so bad. I used the uh, half the bottle here, and as you can tell, it's starting to drain, but still, it is unsatisfactory, right? I mean, obviously, right? So uh, the number one step, the first step to try is the uh, the Drano. This is real good. It did fix, actually, it did fix the um, slow drain in the bathtub, okay? So that one there. So the, the three steps, obviously, is to pour one-fifth, slow down drain, wait for 15 to 30 minutes, and flush the drain with hot water. Repeat steps if necessary, okay? Works for hair clogs, standing water, slow drains, pipe buildup, okay? All that stuff. Safe all in metal and plastic pipes, okay? So there you have it. Anyways, not a commercial for them. Usually that might work because, you know, the, you know, uh, the hair and stuff goes under in the clog and stuff like that. But if it doesn't work, okay, that was number one, right? If it doesn't work, the number two way is to use these, these little snakes here, right? These little plastic snakes. Now these are temporary. You can only use these a few times, but these snakes are pretty long, right? I mean, you can see how long they are compared to my arm. So use the snakes. So what we've got here is we've got a Drain X and it could be anything. It doesn't have to be Drain X, but I'll leave the link in the description below on all these plumbing products, okay? But in this one, in this particular case, we're gonna use a, 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 a snake, an auger, okay? A, uh, so it comes in this little bag here. It's a uh, auger, right? So what we do is we take this, we're gonna take this uh, little cap here off, and then we're gonna take the auger Unscrew this, push that down, and then we screw this, we hold it here, and then we screw it, okay? And that's how we're going to remove the debris. All right, so this is the most, obviously, and, and it's not that expensive. I mean, don't freak out or anything like that. If, if, if the liquid doesn't work and the snakes, you know, the plastic snakes don't work. This isn't one that expensive. It was like 30 or 40 bucks, something like that. I mean, well worth, you know, trying to call a plumber, right? I mean, come on, be honest with you. All right, so the good thing about these is that you don't have to be able to take this stopper off or anything like that. You just stick this thing underneath in there, scrape it out a little bit, and you'll see all this stuff coming up. And I think that um, this will probably be most what the problem is you can see big old clumps of hair and stuff so i don't think that we're gonna need to go with the uh the auger option but i will leave that on the table for you guys obviously uh the drain x i'll leave the link in the description below but luckily we were able to hopefully we'll, we'll test it and everything hopefully be able to clear it on the uh level two step okay so you know, obviously clean this off with the paper towel and then re redo it. So all you do is you take this thing, you stick it down in here, right? 
and you just start start going after it and then pull it out and then you see this thing here so let me show you That's what's in your sink there guys all right so we got a couple of these we'll, we'll probably reuse these a couple of times but you'll see there's plenty of uh, hair and debris and products and whatever it is on both of these so I'm not going to use them all up but uh, yeah these are good I'll leave a link in the description below let's take a look and see the effect all right, so you can see that our method of the, the drain snakes, right? 12 pack, not very much. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description below or in my playlist or in my, the uh, list or up here somewhere. But I mean, I'm gonna throw these couple away, but you could reuse them. I mean, that, that's a 12 pack, but you can reuse them, but it's kind of gross. But you can see how much hair and stuff. Look at that. That was what's in there. And you, I could keep digging, but I'm not gonna, but let's just test it real quick, okay? Let's just test it real quick. Look at that. That is perfect water flow. Perfect water flow, and we didn't even have to remove this piece, which is a pain in the butt sometimes. Look at that, that's perfect, perfect. All because of this, all right? That's what I would highly recommend. Right? See this here. Look at that. Yeah, absolutely. All right, well. All right, well, proof's in the pudding, right? Well, there you have it, guys. I mean, you guys saw how the... Uh... The uh, drain snakes, how the drain snakes did so well. I mean, uh, and we didn't even have to go with the drain axe, you know. The original video was supposed to show you what the drain axe does, but uh, we can save that for later because we don't need to, right? That's the whole point. Do the easiest thing first, right? Boom. If the drain will work first, we'll leave it at that, but it didn't. So then we had to go to the drain snake, right? Drain snake worked. So we didn't have to go with the big one, right? So anyways, leave me a like, comment, share this with someone who has a, uh, a draining problem, right? I mean, the top three ways, right? I mean, boom, you can see my list right there. And uh, pick, you know, I'll have the Amazon links right there for you, okay? So whatever. Anyways, like, comment, subscribe, do the things you do. I wish you much success in your business and in life. And as always... Thank you so much for watching and uh, peace out.